so we have a Target Target drugstore haul slash I don't know slash Ulta haul because the rest have been Ulta where it came in. All right, so oh, if you're wondering what size I'm up to now, I'm a six. I have three more sizes before I'm at the zero. Um, oh, skincare. You guys asked about my skincare. Uh, I don't. Re I don't have a skincare routine because a lot of skincare will break me out or give me a chemical burn. So I do bare minimum. I don't do skincare really at all. I do. I use a makeup. I use these dollar wipes, which wasn't breaking me out. Thank gosh. Um, I have this pharmacy green clean makeup remover I used because um, I double cleanse. And then I've been using this Kate Somerville Goat Milk Face Wash. That's it. And then because my face is naturally dry as the Sahara Desert, uh, when it gets to where it feels like it's cracking off, like it feels like it's going to crack and little pieces falls off, I use a random moisturizer I have that I got in the mail. That's it. All right, on to the haul list. We're going to do the Target first. So here's what I picked up from Target. It's all my stuff, actually. I spent, I got Walmart, I think Walmart's more expensive than Target. I don't know. It's weird. All right, so I picked up the NYX 24-hour matte finish, can't stop, won't stop foundation. Now, whether it's the right shade, that's the question. I don't know if you can even call a drugstore makeup drugstore anymore, really, to be honest with you. Okay, I got the wipe out. Oh, I guess I gotta... There we go, it works. So, it's nice. They're putting stuff, though, in, like, fancier packaging. I like that it's glass. Well, that's, of course, that's been sitting there for a minute. Shake it up real quick. There we go. That took a lot. That was a little watery. Okay. Just go. I don't know about this. There we go. I know it's like normal. That looks... Wow. That's a little light, but it'll work. We can make it work, guys. I can make it work. I don't think you're going to make it work for me, but... Hey, thanks. I volunteered to. My acne's starting to clear up. Ooh. Okay, so we got that foundation. Put it over here so I don't get it mixed up with the Ulta stuff. I did pick up um, Elf Putty Blush in the shade Tahiti. I like the darker blushes. They're favorites. I love them. This is a pretty small blush. Shade Tahiti. Ooh, that's gonna be pretty. That's our Tahiti. If you see a black speck on me, I don't know what it is. It's from the car. We just got a new car in the then you'll wipe down the seat, I think. So that was that blush. I picked up an, I picked up quite a few elf stuffs, to be honest with you. A lot of elf. Elf was a winner, chicken dinner. Then I picked up the um I only seen the one and it wasn't even over in the elf section. It's the uh monochromatic multi-stick and the bronze cherry. It says you can it's a multi-use stick you can use on your eyes, lips, and cheeks. Uh I will be using this on my cheeks. Here's if it says lips and cheeks, I'm going for cheeks. So this is in shade Bronze Cherry, which is the shade I wanted to pick up anyway on Ulta. Ooh, that's a nice orange. Okay. I like that. There's so too much product we get in here. What? That's all you get in there. What a rip. Hopefully it lasts long. <laughs> I 
I think it was only six bucks anyway. Okay, so then I picked up the e.l.f. But it's all over my hand. Oh, it's my jacket. Okay, so we picked up the e.l.f. Glossy Lip Stain in Cinnamon Dreams. Get it out of the box. I've been watching um, Steph's Beauty Sash, and she's been she's got these, and I was loving them. They only had two shades, so on the little thing, oh, what do you call it? Ooh, I'm gonna like this shade. They had this and an orange shade. Ooh, I've been feeling more like browns, neutrals right now. I go through like color phases. And then I got three e.l.f. Um, liquid glitter eyeshadow, so they dry down, and they were on sale for like a dollar fifty, two fifty, two dollars and fifty cents. That's a, that's like a ten dollar, it's almost a ten dollar savings right there, because they're five, five, ten, fifteen. Yeah, that's a ten dollar savings, because this is a five, six, seven dollars and fifty cents for all these. Originally fifteen, not bad. Sale. So, I plan to use them for um, just make a little line right here like just line the lid by the eyelash line yeah that makes sense so this is the shade disco queen get it out of the box these are cute these will go in my single shadows Ooh. That's Disco Queen. Haven't used um, liquid shadows in a while. Probably in over a year, so who knows? I could be really in the mood for them. This shade is, tell me the shade, Ocean Eyes. It's so cute and soft. Here's Ocean, uh, oh wow. That's Ocean Eyes. And then the last one I picked up was Bling Bling. Mm. So, cute little container. There is a bling, so that's a bling bling, ocean eyes, and disco queen. So we got those to try. Wrong, wrong piece of thing here. Oh yeah, you can definitely tell there's glitter in there. Use my bed to wipe off my, dry my hand. <laughs> Oh my gosh, problems for days over here in this general area of my life. I did find a Pixie Tint Plus Hello Kitty Chrome Glow Palette. It's multi-use. It says you can use it. Um, it's a glow palette. It will give you a lift, lift from within luster. It says use it on top of cheekbones, on lids, corner of eyes, and brows. So, let's see. It's a Chrome Glow Palette, Charming Glow. A uh, Pixie is an expensive brand. So here she is. Let's see inside. So like these three shades will probably be used for blush and highlights. So this is gonna be like a highlight blush palette for me. They have the names on the back. It's um, if I'm reading it right. This is a super cute, tickle pink, mimi, kawaii, playful, bow glow, London sweets, lovely luster. Hmm. Well, I might as well swatch it. So, 
That's the first shade. Ooh. It does feel creamy. That's the first row. Pull my wrist sleeve down. Second row. Yeah, it's pretty. That'd be definitely a blush shade right there. No, yeah, that's one of the shades I pointed out for blush. The last row. That's pretty. I like that variety. That's going to be used as a blush highlight palette for me. And inner corner for the eyeballs. So yeah. I don't know where to put it. And then the last thing I picked up from Target was this uh, Soap X Extra Spice Palette from uh, Makeup Revolution. I had the first one, but I um, gave it away. This one looks to be like more colorful. The other one was like uh, mainly nudes. I don't wear a lot of nudes. Here's, here's what the packaging looks like. Nice and shiny. The back of it is just kind of plain. Take off the little protector. Looks like a wee little corner of the palette broke right there. I'm not gonna squash this. Clean up real fast though. Oh no. It had to be a black shade too that broke a little bit in the corner. All right. Oh, anyway, here's the inside. That's cute. So that's what I picked up from Target. So the wee little Ulta haul I have here, I'd show you. Some of the stuff in this Ulta, though, I got one item I didn't buy, so that's a cool free thing, and some items that are going into future giveaways. So, I have the Mickey's and Friends Truth Be Bold Mega Matte Lipstick Trio. This is for a giveaway. It's got three colors. It's a pink, a red, and like a nude. So, that's going to be for you guys. I didn't, my other two ColourPop shades I picked up uh, for the Super Shock Shadows is Dream Much, and I heart this. They're the ultra glitter ones. There's that one. And then Dream Much. Looks like this is the other part of the other one for the Amethyst collection. Got a big mess of boxes on the floor. So here is the Dream Much. So pretty. And then I wasn't expecting this was the uh, Makeup Revolution. This is the Face Palette Versace. It's a dynamic face palette in sorts rose. So this was a unexpected free item. One was not expecting this because one did not buy this, but. As a rule of thumb, it is mine for free. So here she is. This looks like it is a well, let me let the package go. It is, I think it's a blush and highlight palette. Please tell me. Just his face palette. So it's like a blush and highlighter palette. I think. That's what it looks like. I don't know. Like I said, I didn't buy this. But, because this really didn't have packaging, it just had a plastic over thing. Um, 
this blush would be too i don't know i don't think i've used this kind of blush I guess we'll, we'll give her a go we'll see how we like this if not i can always declare it and give it to a friend there's that and then i got this free tart tart thing let's open it up Okay, let's see what we got free from Tarte. So there is a, what is this? It's a Lash Sugar Rush Tarte Lash smooth, Smoothie vol, Volumizing Hemp Mascara. This is actually going to go to a giveaway because I have plenty of mascaras open right now and I don't need this. So, so I'd like to use up some more mascaras. So that's going to you guys. There is a Tarte Double Duty beauty it's the shape tape glow wand i don't think i do i have this one yeah i do have it now i have a smaller size i'm trying not to oh no so now we have a mini size i think this is in a different shade yeah it's a light i have a different shade i kind of have to put like concealers and foundations into the to the giveaway because I just don't know which shades you guys will be and who wins, you know. So we just will do that. Do like blushes and highlights and stuff like that. But complexion products is a whole, whole different story and a whole other beast in general. And I don't want to like disclude somebody, include somebody. And on my part, that would, that's a lot of buying for different shades, just in case you don't know who's going to, you know, win, who can get it. So then we have the Tarte Stay Spray Setting Spray. I have the bigger version, so this will be going to the giveaway. And what's left in here? This is a Sugar Rush Tarte Lip Slip Vegan Lip Oil. Oh, here's what it looks like. I'm not going to swatch it, though. I'm just going to keep it in the, um, in the packaging because this is going to a future giveaway because I don't use a lot of lip oils realistically. So for me, I won't be getting any use out of it. But yeah, this is it. This is my haul. Unexpected surprise palette. Hoping that orange, like that light dusty orange breaks out for me because that's I really like that blush looking thing. I'm thinking it will because, oh, where's it at? Because in the Ro Romance palette I have, I have like, well, nope. Is it the Mo palette? One of these palettes in here. Yeah, it's like a lighter version of this and that looks great. And I also have something similar like from the e.l.f. I think. Yeah, it's like similar to the Elf, so I'm hoping it works. So yeah, uh, that's my haul. Thanks for watching. It's kind of like more of a collectible because everything came in at once. But uh, thanks for watching. Hope to see you in the next one. Bye.